Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice trigonometry problem? We have 4 raised to the power sine square x plus 4 raised to the power 4 square x equals to 5. Here, yeah. x is in between 0 degrees and 90 degrees. Now, recall that we have sine square x plus 4 square x and uh, this is equals to 1. On this identity, let's make cos square x the subject and take sin square x to this side. Then this gives us cos square x to be equals to 1 minus sin square x. And uh, here we can write this equation again now and write cos square x as 1 minus sin square x. And this will be 4 raised to power sin square x plus 4 raised to power 1 minus sine square x then equals to 5 from here then applying the law of indices here when we subtract the power like this it means we have number of the same base dividing each other then we have here as 4 raised to power sine square x then plus 4 raised to power 1 divided by 4 raised to power sine square x which is equal to 5 then we have 4 raised to power sine square x common here so let's let, uh, let y be equal to 4 raised to power sine square x then when we write this in terms of y now we now have y plus 4 over y which is equal to 5 and here the LCM here is y then we multiply through by y so this becomes y square then plus 4 left here then equals to 5y then bring 5y here so we have y square minus 5y plus 4 then equals to 0 so this quadratic equation can be factorized the factors of 4 that give us minus y, we have minus y, then minus 4y. So this will be minus 5y, and this will be plus 4y squared when we multiply. So we have y squared plus 4 to be equals to 0 here. Then, now, on these two terms, we factor what is common, which is y here. So we have y minus 1 left here. Minus 4 common here, also we have y minus 1 left, which is equal to 0. Then from here, y minus 1 common, y minus 1 out. Then we have y minus 4, which is equal to 0 here. So the two cases we have y minus 1 equals to 0, or we have y minus 4 equals to 0. Recall that we represented y as 4 raised to the power sine square x. Then from here, we can take minus 1 here, and this will be y equals to 1 from here, and here y equals to 4. Now, since y equals to 4 raised to the power sine square x, then we have 4 raised to the power sine square x be equals to 1 and when we solve this we can also put 1 in this 4 and that will be 4 raised to the power sine square x will then be equals to 4 raised to the power 0 we are seeing this now we can see sine square x will then be equals to 0 from here then to get to get rid of this square let's take the square root on both sides so square we cancel square root we have sine x now equals to zero from here then on this side as well y is 4 raised to power sine square x which is 4 here which is 4 raised to power 1 also same base we can say sine square x will now be equals to 1 also get rid of this square by taking square root on both sides then we have sine x left here, which is equal to plus or minus 1. Then from here, when we look at the 
quadrant the four quadrant we have this is the first quadrant which is uh, from 0 to 90 degree so from here we have 0 here then we have positive you know as x for x let's say this positive y here this you know positive y as x and that means 90 degree you know lie between the positive of uh, x and y so now for this particular sign x that is zero it means we have zero and then we have zero that means sign zero here will give us zero so here we see x equals to zero for here then from here we have only positive no negative on this side that means sign x which is equals to one now is you know in between the angle of 90 degree so now we say sign 90 degree here is equals to one i mean x from here equals to 90 degree and uh, here we can therefore conclude that the values of x in this given problem are x equals to zero and x equals to 90 degrees so here we have come to the end of this class thank you for watching don't forget the steps subscribe for more exciting videos turn notification bell on share this video give a thumbs up put your comments in the comment section see you in the next class and bye for now